Hey guys, welcome to Vlogmas Day 4. I just wanted to sit down and chit chat with you guys about how my night was at the opera and in the city. I had so much fun with my mom and my sister. So I want to start by letting you guys in a little secret. My family and I love going to the opera. Ever since I was a kid, I can always remember going to the opera and loving it and like running around the Metropolitan Opera House. But recently we've been going more than usual because I am a college student and so this is the tip if you're a college student you get student discounts for nearly every place in the city that's affiliated with like the met opera the um like if you do the research you can find a student discount for literally anywhere so that's my pro tip and the tickets are super cheap if you put your student info so yeah so the opera started at eight o'clock and we live on long island so we did have to leave earlier than we did we were in such a rush my mom you know how they always say like mother knows best but like actually like she told us to leave way earlier than we did but she wasn't even ready so it's not our fault so we made our way to the city actually ended up being late to the opera my sister said that we've been late to the opera before but I have never recalled being late to the opera and it was like so funny to me like just sitting in like the TV lounge because when you come late to the opera they basically send you to like this TV room where they stream the opera but it's like on a big screen and you're like in this smaller theater we were like whatever like we came late and we're definitely like those people who's like what can you do about it now so we got like drinks and a snack got our coats checked in and we visited the bathroom obviously did watch a bit of the opera in the little theater but the quality is not that great and the stream on that screen was so dim like you could barely even see if you were trying and then the first act was over so we got back into the opera house and it was way better like exactly what I needed so in that TV room, they also don't have any subtitles and operas are never in English or like very rarely in English. So I was trying to follow along, like see the emotions and like feel the plot, but I was just like kind of zoning out. But the opera singers were amazing. The uh, soprano singer who was there, she did such an amazing job. And also I wasn't really aware of what Rigoletto was about. But once we got into the opera house, we got our playbills as well. And I read the synopsis and it's actually a really, it was a really awesome story and a really amazing opera to see. So I recommend it to anybody. So that was really awesome. I always love being at the opera. The place itself is so beautiful and pretty. I can't wait to go to more opera. So stay tuned for more videos of that because I'm definitely going to be visiting the opera more this year and also i'm looking into some ballet shows so i'm very very excited about that and then afterwards i swear my mom has such like a soft spot for diners after the opera or like diners in general when she goes to the city she actually used to work in a diner when she first came to america she worked there for like two years straight that's where she met one of her best friends who she's still friends with today they've been friends for like over 20 years <laughs> she just loves a diner after the opera in the city so we ended up going to a diner it was called the ritz diner it's on first avenue closer to like east 62nd street and that place was so lively like there were so many kids <laughs> as we're eating this, like one girl comes in and she's like oh can we get a table for five please and the place was packed so we were like um i just noticed it i didn't say anything obviously but the guy was like uh take a look around but i'm not sure and then me my sister my mom we ended up moving 
from like the free tables to a booth because a booth opened up and we were like oh can we just move there real quick so we moved there before it was like before our food even got there and everything and so we moved to this booth and then the girl's like oh can we use that table right there that we just moved from so they end up uh she ends up like going back out i guess to like get her friends or whatever and literally i didn't notice it like i was not thinking anything of it afterwards and then my sister <laughs> she like <laughs> pointed out some they came back in like the whole group came back in and they sat at the table and it was like behind me and like to the back of me so i i had to like turn around to see anything and my sister like she like says something i forget but it made me turn around and literally i see peter dokas from tiktok so he was literally i saw like i saw him for like a split second i was like is that who i think it is and I started dying. I was just I was just dying like it was so funny to me to see him there like in the flesh I was destined to get a video of him because I was not gonna ask for a picture like come on So I did that like phone trick where you like fake being on the phone and like you're recording and stuff And then we got our food. One thing I want to say, the hot chocolate at this Ritz Diner was I think the best hot chocolate I've ever had from like a diner type restaurant like that. So definitely go to that Ritz Diner if you're looking for the best hot chocolate in the city. We shared a burger, calamari, and this like matzo ball soup. Afterwards, we went on our way home. My other sister, I know you guys have seen, I guess I'll call her my middle older sister, Nicole, but I also have another older sister who's the oldest out of all of us. There's three girls in my family. And she was actually in, she was like touring Europe for this past week. She went to Amsterdam, Germany. So she was also coming home um, the night of the opera. So yeah. Yeah, that was how my night went yesterday also i want to mention that yesterday's video was posted late not because of editing i actually edited it super quickly it was way easier to edit i just was at the opera and the scheduling thing from youtube it like did not work so i had to post it a little bit later but definitely stay tuned for tomorrow's vlogus i'm doing like a sunday reset kind of thing i have to study i'm gonna clean my room all that jazz so make sure to stay tuned bye